To stay updated, subscribe to TJA Academy. Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. In this video, we are going to discuss automatic arima forecasting process. Process as we have discussed in previous lecture in which we have applied box Jenkins method step by step that that arima one zero one one model are appropriate in this automatic arima forecasting we have used us cpi data as in previous lecture from 1971 to 20019 today today we will learn how automatic arima forecasting is applied with the comparison of a step by a step procedure of box Jenkins methodology so as arima zero one one model or applied so uh, we should apply the this model first like go to quick estimate equation And uh, here the CPI or the variable is first difference is stationary. So DCPI space C space MA1 is the appropriate model. And this is the output of Arima 011 model. And uh, now uh, we are going to forecast with the help of manually decide model like forecast CPI F manual and forecast sample is to 2020 to 2028 then press ok so CPI FM is the forecasted value of CPI with the help of manual process now we are going to apply the automatic arima forecasting so first we have to open the variable and we can see 
we have data from 1971 to 2019 and uh, we have made a work file up to 2028 and these are the forecasted period so uh, for automatic Karima forecasting go to process automatic Arima forecasting so here uh, transformation you should select here auto with which one is better here is the maximum difference to make variable stationary so you can write here two here uh, auto system selected max 4 depends on uh, sample size and moving average maximum moving average term is 4 depend on sample size so this is the seasonal pattern but this is the out of the scope of the video this is the estimation sample and estimation sample is from 1971 to 2019 and the remaining period is the forecasting length which is 2020 to 2028 and 9 years now after discussing this step go to option here is the name of forecasted series which is CPI F automatic and select all these options just give the name here and select all the options and press ok so this is the output of uh, automatic arima forecasting this is the summary here we can see that arma model 01 this shows the seasonality and uh, ignore here we should ignore here because uh, we did not consider the seasonal pattern so this model is arma 01 why the model is arma why not arima because automatic arima forecasting consider the different cpi is directly as a dependent variable so when the, the different cpi considered as a dependent variable directly is no need to take difference to make it a stationary so that is why it is mentioned here that is arma 01 model now second one is forecasted graph this red line shows the actual value of cpi from up to 2019 and this is and the blue line shows the forecasted value now the third one is forecast comparison graph these are the different models but the automatic arima forecasting select this red line model here you can see the red line is arma 01 and this is the equation output here you can see this output is the same output as we have done in our previous lecture when we applied box jenkins step uh, box jenkins methodology uh, with by manual procedure so this is the output and which is same as the output is same as we have uh, found in our previous lecture so this is the arima criteria table so here the arma 01 the akai information criteria is minimum here and this is the graphical representation of akai information criteria and we can see this here the arma 01 as the minimum value of akai information criteria so here uh, we can compare also here the output so this is the automatic arima output and this is the manual procedures output and here we can see the all values are same here and we can compare also this uh, cpa forecasting from automatic procedure and from manual procedure if we open these two series as a group we can see that from 2020 to 2028 both values are same whether we have used automatic procedure or we have forecasted through manual procedure so this is 
the automatic edema forecasting with the manual comparison so if this video helps you to understand the automatic edema forecasting to like the video share it and subscribe my channel tj academy